Ah, uh, what a beautiful day it is today. Staring out into the blinding light. Oh god, my eyes! Eee! Hello everyone and welcome back to this little mini-series of Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Rescue Team DX Demo! You know, you could grab that mail if you wanted to. <laughs> Done! I, uh, oh no! I, uh, 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 Ah, <laughs> sorry. I was so excited about today, I've been waiting here since dawn! I must have fallen asleep. Anyway, so I guess he wasn't actually awake looking at the mailbox, just napping. That it marks the start of our rescue team. Let's always do our best. Yes! But, um, we don't have any job offers yet. <laughs> well. That kind of puts a damper on things. Oh yeah, maybe there's something in the mailbox. <laughs> well, there's, de there's definitely something in the mailbox. Check your mail, man. <laughs> it's in the quilt. Well, I guess it's our mail, as specified in the <laughs> in the last one. Said the quilt. Check the mailbox. The mailbox contained a rescue team starter set. I knew it'd be in there. It's a rescue team starter set. Yeah, they always give you one if you start a rescue team. And there's the rescue team, rescue team badge, toolbox inside too, issue of Pokemon news, yes! There are some good things here. First off, the rescue team badge, it shows that we're a rescue team. How are you gonna pin this on me? I'm not wearing clothes. This is the toolbox, used to carry items you find in dungeons. Let's put the stuff Butterfree gave us in here for now, okay. Items are very useful, so let's use them on our adventures. And finally, a copy of the Pokemon News. It's useful for rescue teams. Put the Pokemon News in the mailbox, you should read it later. In the mailbox? You don't want to hand it to me or something? <laughs> Anything else? Is there any other mail? Maybe not? Well, eh, nope. Well, you, there is the letter that you put in there at the news, it's, so it's technically not empty. So there isn't any mail for us after all. That may be good, because that means no one needs rescuing, and that means everything's good. If there are any rescue jobs, we'd be getting mail, but nobody knows about us since we're such a new team, I guess. <laughs> uh, oh. Oh. Oh, wonder what could it be? Whoa! It's a Pelipper. You've got mail. <laughs> we got three letters! Uh, can I? I thought I could sneak between there. Could this be? Pick again, will you check the mailbox, please? Okay. Mm -hmm. Hey, it's a rescue job offer! What does it say? Yeah, let's see. Bzz, 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 bzz. I heard about you from Caterpie. Please, we need your help. Magnemite is in trouble. A strange electromagnetic wave flowed through a dungeon and has struck Magnemite and Magnemite together. That's Magn. That's, uh. The evolved. That is enough to form a magnetot. Never mind. It's not complete the way it is now. Please, I need help. <laughs> Magnemite's friend. Well, you could just go go with them and stick everyone together. And never mind. Ah, uh, what if I say no? I mean, I definitely want to go, but let's say no. No, I don't, but, how? Why? It's our first job. Let's go. How? Huh, why? It's our first job. Let's go. I like how the music just stops <laughs> every time. Listen. <laughs> okay, okay, yes. That's the spirit, let's do our best. Whee! We are off! Oh, we just automatically go. Thunder Wave Cave. Second dungeon of the game. I love the music in this place in the original game. It appears that they have the same awesome upbeat tune to boot. Oh, you're here! <laughs> My friends are in this carriage. <laughs> Our friends should be on base with six flubs and stuff. Yeah, they're, they're kind of a little bit distressed, but we'll get this. We'll make it through. Another wave, okay, basement one floor, let's go! Let's see how it generated. Uh, oh, yeah, I kind of figured that out earlier. <laughs> Apple. Uh, oh, yeah, that's, that's a factor in the earlier mystery dungeon games that you have a belly. You gotta keep yourself full. I don't know if I'll need to eat anything, but it's nice to have on hand. Recipe button open your toolbox is quicker than going from the X menu. Really? So you just oh you just like tap B. It's not it's like a combination. So you don't just B to move to really go. Meh, 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 meh. But other than that, it's uh, so see this it revives a fainted Pokemon. So if someone gets knocked out, that's why I said this one was really handy. This recovers a little bit of HP. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Like a berry covers poison apples that's for the belly but 
they're pretty decent belly-wise, I would say. I think the belly is in the upper right corner. I think it's at 95. I think that's what it is. I, I, I should actually be sure about that, shouldn't I? Status. Um... Where do you see the belly? <laughs> Overview... Uh, status can... I don't know. <laughs> Am I skipping it too quickly to miss? And I'm, and I'm missing it. Well, whatever. I, I'll figure it out later. We're not gonna run out of belly with my skills. <laughs> Alright, so here's a Rattata. Let's see what we can do about that Rattata. Uh, probably should just Vine Whip. Nah, nah. Oh. Ow. Yeah, no. Take that. Yes. And no items. In the oh, shoot. <laughs> that, that's why I should be holding the Y button as I taught in the last part. But I just thought I could control stick it, but no. No, very easy to hit the wrong direction if you're not holding the Y button. Um, I had no choice but to get into a battle with you, huh? huh I think this is all, like, pre-made tutorial stuff in a way still. Well, that worked out nice. And no items on the map. As you'll be able to see a, a blue dot on there, as we have learned. Like, see that three, those three blue dots by the leaf on the left side of the screen there? Well, on top of the leaf there? Yeah, I believe those are items if I remember correctly, so... Uh-oh, this is not good. <laughs> oh, okay, it's a tutorial. If you face multiple enemies at once, you cheat to a corridor or to fight them one at a time. That's definitely a very good idea. As a matter of fact, what you could do as a little... as a little sneaky move here... Remember one move you make in a dungeon, your opponents will also make one move. Turns always go in order. Yeah, I taught that earlier on. On the other hand, if you don't move, neither you, neither will your opponents. Take your time and choose your action wisely. But every time you make a move, like you use an item or you press the A button, attack, that is one move, and then the opponents get to move. So if you want to just think about things, just stay in place and relax. Oh wait, I forgot. Can I talk to you? I don't know what's ahead. Stay sharp. Let's keep moving. Try not to get careless. Don't give up. You don't know what's ahead. Stay sharp. Oh, you got a lot of, a lot of dialogue there. Okay, um, so here's here's a neat little trick here. What you can do is you keep, you can keep backing up and let your let your partner attack what's in front of you if they have a ranged move. So I'm gonna move that. Oh, I didn't mean to do that actually. Well, whatever. <laughs> I just pressed A button to do you know the, the skip the turn. But I guess if you use the A button, no matter what, it's just you do an attack. But yeah, if the Voltorb was directly in front of me and I just kept moving back like this, uh, Syndicule would continually attack that Voltorb for me, and I'd basically be out of range of being attacked, keep everyone protected and everything like that. It's it's a little part of the Mystery Dungeon strategy, so... <laughs> uh, let's see what we get here. Hold R and use L to walk that... Oh, so you can use R as well as the Y button then. I see. Oh, oh, oh no, it's separate. That's right, that's right. I see, I see. Tutorial, tutorial, tutorial. Apple, Max Ether, and Orenberry. We already know what those kind of are, so. Wait, actually. Did I get a. Did I see. Whoops. Did I see. I mean, did I show you what the. No, I didn't show you a Max Ether. I did mention that Ether recovers the uh, power points here and moves. And you'll notice that the uh, items are all separate. You can press the Y button to sort them, but they all stay separate. The reason for this is because your toolbox has a limit. See, it's 8 out of 32. So you can only take so and so many things out of a dungeon, and you can only take so and so many things in a dungeon as a result of that. So be very wise about what you choose. Um, so I'm going to try this again. A button? Yes. <laughs> Yeah, it's just like, I don't I don't understand why A button isn't just a regular attack here. Hold down ZL and choose which move you want to hold with A, B, X, or Y. I, I already kind of figured that one out myself. And we won, anyway. I mean, that's, I mean, we beat that floor, so let's go to the next one. On the Wave Cave. Oh, jeez. If you're in a dungeon and fail in your adventure, you lose all the items and money you're carrying. Oh, no! Oh, no! We're okay. Okay, so what... Now, what if I were to just press the E button here? Will it be Vine Whip? No, it's Seed Bomb. So, it's like a random attack, depending on whether or not you can hit? I... guess? I... not sure? You go grab that, I'll go grab the other one. There you go. That is teamwork at its finest. I might actually want to go battle the critter down there, so it's going to be following us the whole time. Oh, and these X's here recover status conditions. They're called Wonder Tiles. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Well, I should say it's for the numerical stats, not so much the, uh, 
uh, like poison paralysis, that sort of thing. That, that, that one recover that. It's more about the stats. So Anyway, so I'm going to skip... A, actually, wait. If I face this way and use the A button... It's so weird. <laughs> that did... Oh, I didn't mean to, I didn't mean to push you. Uh, yeah, it's just... I don't, I, don't know, I don't know about that. Uh, there, there might be more to it. Um, okay, we're good. And, oh! Oh, I shouldn't have done that. I should have just pressed the A button. Anyway, uh, I probably should just tackle that. There we go. Very nice. Very nice. Level up! Stats go up! Let's not beat that. Excellent! I level up! And we'll smoke... Oh! That is a really good move in Mystery Dungeon. Because it basically prevents the opponent from attacking for... Well, actually... It, this one just says it lowers the enemy's accuracy, but in other games it made the opponent what they call a whiffer status, and it made the opponent completely miss as long as that status was in effect. I don't know if it's any different now, but... Hmm... Hmm... Anyway, I should probably drop Facade uh, for a smoke screen to try that out. It's, it's a demo game anyway, so... <laughs> and let's go. Yeah, I don't, I, Typically I don't use Facade because I'm not aiming to get a status effect, you know what I mean? <laughs> uh, that could be a, a nice move in competitive regular Pokemon battling, but in Mystery Dungeon, status effects really wear you down. So generally you just want to heal them as soon as you can. Anyway, next floor, Basin 4. And you can change the leader. The Pokemon you control by pressing plus, you'll be able to control a Pokemon other than just the hero. So I can switch now? You can check how to play by pressing the minus button. You can find a lot of good tips for adventuring there. Oh yeah, look at that! It also doesn't seem to waste turns. <laughs> oh, that is the belly! Yeah, yes, yeah, at the upper right corner, see how it's 67? 100, 67, 100. I remember in Mystery Dungeon games, only your belly seems to go down, not your partner's, for some reason. So I guess that would be a way to extend your belly, is just switch to your other partner. So I guess it could be Syndiquil for a while. And minus is... Oh, it's the same place that we were at before, okay. So, yeah, I'm gonna try Cyndaquil then for a little bit. Oh, should not have been so reckless there. I should have watched the map, but that was that was okay account anyway. Um, uh, probably Bamber, I suppose. All oh, right, I was gonna try Smokescreen. Well, I'll have another, another opportunity to use Smokescreen. See the Whiffer status, if, it, if it's still a thing here. And got the apples, I got the monies. Actually, maybe I should... Oh, there's just another one just to spawn there. Oh, they're going both directions. Maybe they'll meet me up here. In this room. I just want to see all the rooms basically while I'm collecting stuff. Okay, let's try the smoke screen now. <laughs> Miss. Oh man. Ow. Smoke screen, I say. Uh and yeah, it's just accuracy, not whiffer. So I guess it just reduces accuracy rather than yeah, I guess smoke screen was really overpowered in the original game. The same with protect and detect, because it prevented you from taking hits for however many turns, just like smoke screen does, so. Yep. Anyway, Poochie and out. Uh-huh. And good. Good. Oh, no, oh, she had another one spawn. You know what? Let's just go. <laughs> We're gonna be battling random spawns all day and all night if we just do it that way. And we're off. So yeah, normally if I was, like, just playing this in speedrun fashion, I'd be doing stuff like that. Just kind of mashing through things really quickly. Ooh, level up. Very nice. <laughs> I was, I was wondering why this Bulbasaur didn't get the love. I mean, <laughs> wait, I mean, never mind. The uh, they both got never mind. I, I, I was thinking that the uh, Leech Seed is that. Hmm. I don't know if I want that. That's it's very slow in this game. I, I guess I could try it. Maybe, perhaps. Uh. I don't know if I should. I don't know. I guess I'll replace Tackle. I, mean, I don't want to have three grass moves, but I want to try everything if I can, you know what I mean? But... <laughs> and I also forgot what I was saying. Mm. Oh yeah, about, about being speedy. Like, if I was just running through the game at my normal pace, I would just be going mmm, 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 like that, but since I'm just kind of getting the ropes of things... This is this a gravel rock? It's a gravel rock, isn't it? Oh, it's... It sets stones or spikes by throw, but XP plus 2, ZL, or plus ZR to register... I see, that's like other games. So, then we go B button, right? right. B button, yeah. 
And then... What was the register? It was... How did it... Uh, oh, okay, register at Z, all of us Z are alright, so... Yeah, that is a gravel rock, and that, I believe that does a set damage of 20, if I remember correctly. Eh, yep. Yay, indeed! Let's check out... Actually, I think it's all covered, huh? Because that, that hallway will just connect to the other one. Uh, yeah. I think that's it. <laughs> Unless you want to battle that other one, but nah. This is going to keep spawning, as mentioned. Oh, man! They are stuck! <laughs> oh, there they are. Let's get them out safely. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Yay! Cindy Quill successfully completed the job at Thunderwave Cave! Yay! Well, actually, we kind of both did, but... <laughs> so I told you the belly wouldn't be a factor. It's too early in the game. The dungeons have to be longer for the belly to be a, a real deal factor. Our body separates! <laughs> Rejoice! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> be thankful, you two. You are our heroes, thank you! <laughs> All he did was use rubber. We're just not complicated. <laughs> Big apple! More for the belly. I should say it refills the belly more than an apple. Another orange belly for the health. 650 bucks or six dollars and fifty cents. You decide. I'm so glad our rescue the rescue mission went so well today. It's probably more like six dollars fifty cents, actually, based on how things cost in the game. Anyway, I need to confess, since that was our first job as a rescue team, I was really, really nervous. Can't believe how tired I am. I'm going to go home and get some sleep. Let's do good again tomorrow. See you. Okay. Wait, so that isn't your home? Wait a second. <laughs> yeah, I know, I know. <laughs> I know that from the first game that they hang out in the other, other outskirts and yeah, anyway. Where... Where am I? Maybe... Is this a dream? It's a very lucid dream. Oh jeez, I'm still naked. Oh, there's uh, someone here. Who is it? Someone I know. Hmm, I can't remember. I don't see anyone. I think I dropped something, but I can't quite remember what the dream was about. Oh well, today's not the day of rescues. I wonder if I have any mail. Better check that mailbox. Well, better check the mailbox. There's mail! Peek again, check the mailbox. But there's no mail seeking help from the rescue team. Oh, oh I forgot to check the newsletter. They just kind of threw me into the <laughs> the dungeon, so maybe I didn't forget. They just didn't give me a shot. Good morning, Pika Gam. Aren't you up early? Oh, uh, so you checked the mailbox? So is there anything? Was there any rescue requests? Nope. Huh? There's nothing? Uh, I guess that makes sense. After all, we've only just begun. Oh well, we should go to Pokemon Square. We should check the Pelipper Post Office. I think they'll have jobs posted. Pokemon Square is over here. Let's go. Okay. Do, 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 do. Oh, it's still not letting me check the news. <laughs> this is Pokemon Square. Oh man, it's a bustling town. Why didn't you show me this earlier? <laughs> this is where you can buy stuff. This is a Cactuleon shop. You can buy and sell items there. Yay! Do, 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 do. Yeah, I really like the jittery kind of art style that's going on with the characters and stuff like that. It's very, very charming. That's Felicity Bank. You could save your money. I mean, you could save your Pokemon money there. Ah! ah. <laughs> just remember, they, they could just call the money, okay? This is the Goldman Link Shop. Goldman Link, link moves for you. Hmm? Huh? What's linking? Well, if you link moves, you can use them together at the same time, but it also uses PP for each of the moves at the same time as well. You should just ask Gulpin for details. <laughs> just like, I don't know what this is. Let's, let's, let's move on! This one look good. Nah, no, <laughs> not really. This is Kangaskhan the Stone. If you store items here, they'll be safe. Yeah, you won't lose them if you should get KO'd in the dungeon like you would otherwise. You should store important items here before you go up to go to a dungeon. That bell sprout there is kind of a newbie, I think. <laughs> and over there is the Makuhita Dojo. I wonder if that's open. That'd be another dungeon I could do. do, 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 do. Ha! Ooh! At the dungeon? <laughs> I mean, at the dojo, you can learn or get training on various maneuvers used in dungeons. Yep. Definitely have to show that if I can. What do you think? The business is here to help us. 
Oh, and there's also the Pelipper Post Office. Yeah, we we were getting there. <laughs> That's us up past here. What about uh, Wishcash Pond? I think we can get rescue jobs information there. So how about we go to the Pelipper Post Office first? I mean, I guess we could. Your partner will tell you all kinds of things. You're not sure where to go? Just ask your partner. So can I, like, just... Oh, yeah. Look, PKM, the Pelipper Post Office. Off to the Pelipper Post Office we go. You were trying to greet me. I know, Lotat. I mean, Lombre. <laughs> Why did I say Lotat? Lombre. I don't know why, but there are many natural disasters lately. My Pokemon have become wild and violent because the das disasters scared them. It's a mean world out there. Uh, I was a forest fire not long ago. It was terrible. The Blastoise and Feraligator were able to dulce it quickly. Nice. They used Rain Dance. But it could have been much worse that they were slow were slower getting there. Uh, pardon? Oh, the Pelipper Post Office? The Pelipper Post Office would be... Yeah, straight down this path. I see. It's out at the Cape. You can't miss it. Um, oh yeah, that's right. The, the bell spell just wanders around. I don't know why it was, was hanging over here a minute ago. But anyway, I want to see what's at the shop. Uh, welcome to Kecleon Wares. You can find TMs. Yep, you can get some moves for your critters. When a team is sparkly, it means one of your teammates can learn a move from that team. That's good to know. Yeah, because I was never really sure about that <laughs> in, the, in other games. You know what I mean? It's just kind of kind of assumed. So yeah, obviously that's for Cyndaquil. Let's see what else we have here. They're all pretty expensive though, so maybe I'll just hold off on that because I got decent moves anyway. Alright, hey. Hello, welcome to Cuckleon's shop! Take all the time, you're like at a different sort of shop. Um, oh, a skateboard might be nice. Because, uh, well, it doesn't work in like boss areas if I remember. Yeah, so... But it's, it's like if you're in trouble and you, you see yourself gonna lose, you can just kind of use that and escape with your items and stuff like that. But, you know, you have to restart the dungeon from the beginning, of course. Uh, one shot orb defeats all enemies in the same room in a single shot. Sometimes it misses, but using it in a monster house is really powerful. That actually could be handy. I don't know if I'll encounter a monster house in this, but I probably should grab those just in case, because monster houses, if you've never, if you've never been in them before and you don't have, uh, some sort of item like this, or a, uh, a move that can attack the entire room at once, you might be in serious trouble. Let's just, let's just, let's just put it that way. I think the rest of the items can can stay as they are. I don't think I don't think I'll need the escape orb. Uh, no, I didn't, I didn't need that one. No, 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 there, with the King's Gun Sword. So yeah, if I want to put stuff in here, and I probably do want to just put all the stuff... Oh yeah, that's right, um, I want to select multiple items. There we go, R button for the multiple selections. I just want to basically store a couple of things here, either to one of my moves. That would probably be better than that early in the game, because I don't want to lose that. Definitely should keep the Gravel Rock for surprise damage. I guess I'll put the apples... And maybe one more. Yeah, I'll just put that in there. Now they're safe, so if I lose in a dungeon, they are still waiting for us to take out later. And the same with uh, the bank over here, which is probably what you want to do next after you buy items and stuff like that, is deposit all the money that you got so that you don't lose that if you should lose in a dungeon. Oh, I got an apple. Thank you very much. Thank you. I await your next visit. Uh, Gulpin. So, Gulpin Link Shop. So, what's move memory? So, look at you ch look, change what moves you know? You remember? Oh, interesting. I don't remember this in the first game. Was it in the first? Maybe it was. I don't know. But yeah, uh, move memory is a thing where uh, if you forget a move, I guess, yeah, uh, you can get it back, like, say, the. Uh, uh, Whoops. Uh, yeah, like, remember we dropped the... Oh, there was Growl? <laughs> I guess that makes sense, because this is, like, partway through the game, so to speak. I think in this demo, probably. Anyway, so you'd like to change the moves, you know. Do you remember a move? Forget it. No, no we're, we're... I think we'll go with move moves here. Yeah, Growl. Anyway. Uh, Pelipper Post Office. Oh, wait, no, no, one, one more thing. Wishcash Wish Pond, if it's here. Uh, oh, it's not a screen transition. Very neat. Our treasures open up in the ground here and there. Trouble for everyone. It worries me to no end thinking that children will fall down into them. Oh man. Oh man. No, 
That's all you got, huh? Okay. So, no, 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 okay. <laughs> I, thought, I thought we were gonna go into a chain again. We're good, though. Alright, Pelipper... Post office, I couldn't go through that, alas. I get lost. Oh, that... I, I was gonna see if I could check that house's mailbox or anything for kicks, but that's okay. That building is a Pelipper post office. And that board over there is what we're looking for. Do, 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 do. This is where information is gathered from Pokemon needing rescue. See? Have a look at this bulletin board. List rescue jobs. Check it out. Da da da! Bulletin board. Oh wow. Ah. Uh, mmm. Mmm. Probably should do this in the next part, but I could accept them all. <laughs> I could definitely do all of them for sure. But yeah, you can see the reward that you get for completing them. Um, what what kind of thing it is? You got to find a famous stone somewhere in the in the dungeon. That sort of thing. Got to bring back Voltar. Got to find the female Nidoran. But yeah, I'm gonna accept all of them and accept the jobs. You go to here. I believe you have to actually open them. Oh no. Okay. Okay. It's it's actually active automatically. Okay. I was going to say, because before you would actually have to accept the job in the original game, but it's just automatically set over here. I think they did that in the original game because people didn't, I mean, they didn't know if people wanted to take all the jobs in one shot, but generally people did, and they were like, okay, maybe we should just put it like this, just have them accept it automatically. Okay, so we're set. See? There are jobs listed, right? If you want to do a rescue job, choose a job, and go to the dungeon that's indicated. You can do the dungeons by taking the path near the base. Okay. And while well, we're starting out, we should handle the jobs that are posted here. Doing that, I got them all! Doing that should get our team some recognition. That should pull in job offers through our mailbox soon. Speaking of that mailbox, I <laughs> You can't just get jobs. Okay, same thing. Uh, oh, okay. I see. I see. I was gonna see if I could talk to peeps in there, but nah, can't. Uh, so yeah, I guess I'll do all those jobs in the next part. <laughs> so with that, I'm gonna end off the part here. Hope you enjoyed, and I will see you in the next video when I do so.